Welcome to my fourth uh, German lesson. Now, in this German lesson, I will teach you um, some things to eat and to drink. But well, before we can start with these things, I will uh, teach you the, wor uh, the verbs to eat and to drink. Now, let's begin with to eat and things to eat. To eat means in uh, German Essen. Um, and the congregation is for um, I eat, ich esse, uh, you eat, du isst, he, she, it is, uh, eats, er, sie, es, isst. Where the difference is for to he, she, it is, um, that you will spell it, uh, he, she, it eats with double S. Um, we eat is wir essen. You eat is um, ihr esst, and you eat. Er, they eat is um, die, uh, sie essen. Well, uh, when in German, when you uh, wanna say that you eat something, you do like in English the end of uh, indefinite article. Well, the following things I will tell you in the definite article, and so in der for male, d for female, and das for um, not your nouns. But the indefinite articles are just easier um, because, but they have to tell you the things between the male and female. In Norge, because for Norge male, the indefinite article is the same as ein, and for the female, it's ein. For example, bread, das Brot in German. Um, when you want to say, I eat a bread, you say, ich esse ein Brot. Uh, other words for eating are, for example, cheese, der Käse, salad means der Salat. For the egg, you say um, das Ei. For ice cream, you say simply das Eis. Pizza is easy because it's die Pizza. For pasta, you say um, die Pasta, or also die Nudeln. Uh, jam is die Marmelade. For uh, chocolate, you say die Schokolade. For ham you say der Schinken. Uh, salami means die Salami. And since this is a plural word, you keep the um, indefinite article where you say for plural things you don't have a definite art indefinite article like I eat salami, ich esse Salami. Uh, for sausage you say most which you usually mean from Bratwurst. Uh, uh, then for Schnitzel is the same as German. Um, das Schnitzel. Honey means uh, der Honig. For carrots you say die Karotte or also die Möhre. Potatoes mean uh, die Kartoffeln, which is again plural. Same with tin tomatoes. Uh, means the um, tomaten, the singular is the tomate. Onions mean um, the zwiebeln, but the singular is the zwiebel. Uh, for spinach, you say der spinat. Uh, cucumber is um, the gurke. For garlic, you say der knoblauch. Uh, and, but in this for garlic, you also say without end of the article, so ich esse Knoblauch. Uh, for cream, you say die Sahne. For fruits, you say um, die, das Obst oder auch die Frucht. And some fruits for you to learn is um, for lemon, you say uh, die Zitrone. For peach, you say the um, and uh, sorry, um, peach you say der Pfirsich. For strawberry you say die Erdbeere. 
for cherry you say uh, die Kirsche uh, for banana you say die Banane and for apricot you say uh, die Aprikose well, um, things to drink, but first again, like the street, the uh, word to drink in German. Uh, the word to drink in German means trinken. And the conjugation is regular, um, and it is ich trinke. Du trinkst, or you drink, and first was I drink. Uh, then he, she drinks means uh, er, sie es trinken, uh, trinkt. Um, we drink means we trinken. For you, uh, you drink, so plural you say ihr trinkt. And for they drink, they you say sie trinken. As for drinks, you always keep away the, or mostly keep away the definite article. For example, water means Wasser. And for you say I drink water, you say like in English, ich trinke Wasser. Other things to drink are, for example, milk, which means milch, uh, coffee, kaffee, also articles, das Wasser, die Milch, and uh, der Kaffee. Uh, for tea, you say, you say der Tee. Uh, Coke means die Cola. Uh, for hot chocolate, you say the heiße Schokolade. For beer, you say um, das Bier. Not just I drink beer. Uh, ich trinke Bier. Uh, for wine, you say uh, Wein, der Wein. Uh, sparkling wine means in German der Sekt. Um, juice means der Saft. And lemonade means the limonade. Uh, with this, I will start this uh, lesson for today, and I hope I could teach you some other interesting things in German. And I hope you enjoyed and learned about more German. And I hope to see you in the next lesson. And I hope to get many good comments from you. Thank you.